Hi everyone, I'm back for the monthly newsletter and today we're covering food allergy testing and candida testing. Food allergies. People come in all the time with these food allergy tests that say I can't eat this and I can't eat that and they're so sad and they're so depressed. And I said, you know, the gut is inflamed. The microbiome, which is the good to bad bacteria balance in the GI tract, is out of balance. And that's from years of poor habits and stress and environmental toxins. So I find that that test is not accurate. When you do an anti-candida program for 90 days and you clear up the gut and get everything balanced, I guarantee if you retest, you're going to see different things come up. And if you're having challenges after 90 days of doing a program, that would be the better time and money better spent if you're going to do food allergy testing. The more important thing that people ask me all the time is, is there an accurate way to know if I have yeast overgrowth? And my quick answer is no. We have not perfected the testing. There's a blood test, there's a stool test, there's a spit test, and you can do a nasal swab. The issue is that candida is ubiquitous. It naturally is part of our ecosystem. And so it's very difficult to be able to determine if yeast is out of balance. And I also think because we're just, science is now just coming into the microbiome and studying the gut, what we have not put the funds into is the mycobiome, which is the fungal part of our ecology. And I think with time, we will have more of an accurate test. So even in my book, you have the written test and you might score low on it. Here's my best advice to you. I feel everyone today is dealing with yeast overgrowth. It's whether it's mild, moderate, or severe. Severe would be more cases of a chronic condition, autoimmune disease, or cancer. And really, if you're doing my Candida Cure program for 90 days, there's no downside to it. You're going to restore vitality, and if you have anxiety and depression, it'll lift. You're going to drop inches without even trying. So you have nothing to lose and everything to gain, because everybody wants quality aging, and you want to hit the reset button. So this is your opportunity, and I do wish that we had the correct testing, but we're just not there yet. So my advice to you is read the book, See if it makes sense to you and then go for it. All right, until next time, have a great month.